Hello, travels out there. Today in this video, I'm just going to be telling you guys about what I got to on my Monday. I hope you've all had a great weekend, and I've all had a great Monday so far. It's a little bit windy at the moment. It was very sunny earlier on, but now it's got a little bit cloudy, and I think it may rain, which I'm happy for because I absolutely love the rain. The smell and sound of rain is so soothing, and I just can't wait to go and dance in the rain and feel the earth beneath my feet. I just absolutely love the rain. It's so soothing. I love falling asleep to the sound of rain. And yeah, I got ready for the day ahead to all the commotion of my younger sister getting a call from my younger brother's work, her twin brother's workplace, and they said how he'd collapsed and how he had pain on his right side of his body. So my dad dropped my mum up to the place where my younger brother works and went off in an ambulance with him and my dad then got back and I had some toast and a cupcake for my breakfast, had a shower, went onto my Facebook to Instagram, my younger sister's mate came over, my older sister and my older brother are at work and my dad then went off back to work and me and my younger sister and her mate went off in a pool and did a massive whirlpool and it was so much fun. And then my younger sister's mate, who's really into photography like myself, and has said how she really likes my doll photography nature pics, which is a very lovely compliment from the likes of her, who's amazing at photography. Took some really cool photos of my young sister in the pool, like laid back floating on her back with the hair floating back, and they are awesome. Then I got out of the pool because it was getting a bit chilly. Got changed, went onto my Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, tweeted a bit, chatted to my mates on Facebook, and posted some photos onto my Instagram. And then for my lunch, I had a sandwich and a cup of tea, and then texted my mum a bit just to see how my younger brother's doing. He just has a really bad migraine, as he's prone to getting really bad migraines. So he's sick, and now he's just sleeping off. So he should hopefully be home this evening. He should be. My dad's going to pick him up after work. And I then watch some vlogs and some vines and I'm a bit frustrated because I ordered three new Barbie dolls off Amazon and they were supposed to arrive today unfortunately they haven't arrived yet so I'm guessing they're going to be coming in the next few days but I just have to keep an eye out for that so who knows when they shall arrive I was having a bit of a bad hair day but I think my hair looks reasonably okay after being in that pool. I had a shower and then went in the pool so it made my hair go a bit crazy but I think it's looking reasonably okay and I watched some clear episodes and listened to a bit of Pat and Disco, Tom Gwen and Kylie Moog while I was working on my book, working on a new chapter of The House of Wolf Not Hill. It's going really well and I watched some vlogs and some vines and watched the Dollhouse Tour videos and it does a dozen doll stuff of Ewe, Amazon Smith and watched some doll show stuff that some people have created like my fog stuff Sam, Mickey and some other sites like that that I um, subscribed to and looked at some awesome doll photography snaps that people have placed on Instagram. Then I watched some Supernatural episodes and some Doctor episodes and some Torture episodes. Did a bit of doll photography and played my main project doll and got my project dolls out for me to sort out. And I watched Love, Simon. I absolutely love Love, Simon. It's such a great film. Hashtag LGBT, hashtag love wins. And it's such an emotional roller coaster of a film. And it's just so funny, so sweet, and such a great film. I've watched it about a billion times already because I absolutely love it. The cast are great. The actors and actresses in it are awesome. And it's just such a great film. It's one of these films that you can watch over and over and over again and still not get tired of. And last night I couldn't sleep, so I ended up watching a bit of TV while I was writing my journal and I just couldn't f work out what film I wanted to watch so I ended up watching a little bit of Zombieland and a little bit of Ever After and Live Action Cinderella and then ended up watching the whole of Love Actually don't judge me here I know it's not Christmas yet or winter time or any time near watching that but Love Actually is just such a great film that it's one of those films that you can watch any season, no matter what weather, I just love Love Actually, and it makes me feel nice and warm inside, and it's just 
such a lovely film and it just makes me so happy and it's such a cleverly made film and so I ended up watching that and then finished off watching Ever After and then ended up going back to bed and I slept like a baby and I had such a good night's sleep had quite a few weird dreams most of my dreams end up getting put into my book series because my dreams are so crazy and just bonkers just like myself and I then watched some episodes of Full and Grace, Friends, Big Bone Theory and How I Met Your Mother and some other comedy stuff and blimmin heck in a minute I feel like I'm going to end up getting blown away by the wind like the nannies from Mary Poppins at this bit because the wind is pretty crazy at the moment but so let me, let's just try and get this vlog done before I end up getting flown into the wind and I played with a bit of Playmobil and Lego hashtag big kid here and played some cards and board games with my sister and her mate and we played on the Wii on Wii bowling and I won hashtag champion and we then played on Buzz and played some cards of board games and played some quiz trivia games that I've got in little cardboard boxes of like quizzes from the 80, uh, 80s quiz and music quiz and then I watched the stuff off the court and beam side player and put locker and caught up on Cassidy and Holby and watched some Dofty, Will and Sunny and Malik and Wobble and stuff and some other fandom fids and watched some fanfic with some fanfic and watched some multi fun and stuff and I watched this gay short film last night and it is so adorable, I absolutely loved it and I watched some vlogs and some vines and some classic Disney show stuff like Liz and Grier, That's the Raven, Kim Possible and some other stuff like that I watched some stuff off Nickelodeon, Blue and Wine, CBC, Cartoon YouTube and CBC and I watched Perfect Vampire Slayer, Teen Wolf, Vampire Dies, and some other wealth and vampire stuff. And watch Surgeon Adventures, Tortured, Dot 2, Supernatural, Tortured, and watch some more Tortured episodes and this special Tortured documentary. And on the 17th of July, we're going to be getting a 30th anniversary special about Home and Away. And I did not know that Heath Ledger was in Home and Away. And also on the 17th of July, there's going to be the trailer for the summer on Hollyoaks called Hollyoaks SOS. And I cannot wait for that. And I tidied my office up for my been working on my book series, getting to a really good part of my book. Lots of Tristan Turns is going really well, absolutely love it. Hashtag White's Book Back Off. Lots of Cups of Tea, Cardio Note, Tom Gwen, and Paddy Disco's new albums have been keeping me going in a zone and I read a bit to my young sister who was very impressed with the new part it's a bit more dark, edgier kind of style of writing that I've been doing and I watched some 30 Moves Y episodes some Charmed episodes and I had a cup of tea and I had the last of my strawberry milkshake and had a bowl of soil and then was tidying my dogs and dogs up from my been playing my dog with the show and I did some filming and editing of that Put some of the new dolls on display and some of the older dolls back in storage and then sorted my pre-trial dolls out and then some doll photography with those and then some dolls and dolls photography in my dog and such a set and sorted the props and sets out and I watched Henry and Neighbours from today and watched some old Henry and Neighbours stuff and some Mob and Malik stuff and watched some old Emmerdale, Hollyoaks, EastEnders, Coronation Street and other soap stuff and watched Waterloo Ridge, Green Show, Degrassi and some old soap stuff that's not even on anymore and watch Shortland Street Hobby Country Doctors and some other medical drama stuff and watch The Bill, CSI and some other police drama and some crime investigation stuff like Miss Marple, Midsummer Murder, Murder She Wrote, Farbrand and some other stuff like that and watch some episodes of Birds of Feather and watch Lisa and Lorraine this morning and the Wendy Williams show and the Alan DeGeneres show and some other torture stuff I'd love to have my own talk show, it'd be so cool but my mum says I'd have to let the guess chat as well because I could just chat for England that has been said a lot and I also would love to star white and create my own TV soap because I watch enough of them and I went to the soap magazine and sat in the shade with a cup of tea and went to Vogue magazine and soap magazine catch up on my gossip so you know how much I love my gossip I read some Marvel and DC comics and I watched one of the Spider-Man films and Batman films and watched some manga and anime stuff and I would love to have my own dollar now, like 
Barbie, it would be a Duke 2, and I have my Peter dolls, which I love, and I was sorting those out, started with one, and I have five of them, and so I was sorting the hairs and outfits out, and it's like a blooming military operation when sorting my Peter dolls out, because there's the hair, the outfits, the shoes, the accessories, all of that to sort out, so it normally takes me a good day or so to finally get them all dressed up, and then I do the doll photography and stuff, so I'm going to be sorting those out, can't wait for Wednesday me and my older brother are going with my older me and my older brother are going with my uncle and his girlfriend and our cousin to Bristol Zoo and then we're going back to my grandpa's house. They have my grandma's specialty, her cottage bite, which I love. So I'm really looking forward to that. And yeah, I'm now off to go finish up my pre-toes out and then gonna be watching some more Doctor episodes and Supernatural and One and Grace episodes and then working on some new songs, playing on my keyboard a bit and learning some new songs that my young sister is helping me learn on the keyboard and then I'm going to be watching The Creative Showman and some other musicals and having a bit of a musical marathon I hope you've all had a great Monday I've had a great week so far I had a great Saturday week and I have had a lovely weekend just gone and I shall see you soon with a new book coming very soon. Bye!